Hey guys, so I want to do another video here about iOS 8 because uh, 9to5Mac have posted a long article about iOS 8 actually and I want to go a little bit more in depth uh, about this main key feature that it seems like Apple's going to focus on in iOS 8 and that is going to be this um, health book app. Um, so they're going to have big focus on health and, and fitness as well. Uh, so the, I think this article also is having a lot of pictures pictures of apps in the app store uh, that is uh, tracking your fitness and tracking your health uh, but also some renders that they have been doing themselves uh, based on some rumors about the new health book app um, so first of all uh, here seems to be all many of the things that you'll be able to track in the health book app and also that's going to be, be having kind of like the same ui look as the passbook app this app also might be an app that is taking uh, information used as the passback app taking information from other various apps uh, and bring it into one place where you can find it all so it seems like healthbook might be able to um, know your blood uh, know your heart rates uh, your hydration uh, blood pressure uh, your activity your nutrition what you're eating your blood sugar and also have an emergency card which sounds pretty hardcore uh, which will, will have your blood type uh, your length and now of course here comes like privacy issues and what happens if someone puts in fake blood type and all that kind of interesting stuff but uh, uh, this app really seems to be wanting want to track everything about you uh, I mean look at this sleep blood sugar nutrition activity oxygen saturation your weight be able to track all of that inside of an app that would be pretty pretty insane uh, pretty cool actually if, if they might or if they would be able to pull that off uh, then that would be pretty cool um, I mean here you can see uh, I think this could be a render or a concept or something um, how it might uh, would be able to look like that you'll be able to track your week month uh, your activity your steps I don't really think most people are that interested uh, in everything like what they're doing and that they want to have an app like this but uh, then of course there's a lot of people using fitness apps um, and health apps uh, so it would be interesting how this would work uh, how would it be able to track your heart rate and blood pressure uh, would it need some kind of a third party accessory I mean we have heard a lot of rumors about like an iWatch maybe the watch has some sensors or something that would be able to track those things uh, maybe it's a kind of armband or something that you need to buy or something uh, I mean here you can see also a picture of the app store you can see a lot of apps uh, that is meant to track different things uh, would kind of suck if you had an app like this and knowing Apple would work on this and that uh, iOS 8 might be uh, having a lot of big focus here uh, on this health book app um, but also some other things of course that I've been talking about in, in other videos like maps uh, and uh, like upgrades to the maps app and, and uh, CarPlay and, and uh, some other things that I might talk about in other videos. Uh, here you can like kind of like see a render of like an emergency card, how that would look like, uh, or kind of potentially could look like your blood type, your eye color, your weight, uh, everything about you, even your name and birthday. Uh, pretty cool, pretty interesting. Uh, we're gonna see what's gonna happen definitely later this year uh, like this summer at the WWDC conference with the uh, uh, where we hope probably is going to see a, a brand new version of iOS uh, be released probably hopefully to developers this summer like an iOS 8 beta or so then we might see more about this health gap maybe it's something that we won't even see this year maybe in iOS 9 or something uh, but um, it's going to be interesting it's going to be interesting to see what they are going to do and I mean summer is really really closing in uh, and here you can also see some other things there that I mentioned in iOS 8 that's probably going to be a big deal on the maps uh, some small improvements across the whole UI of course probably not going to see a super big new render uh, of the UI uh, overhaul of, of, uh, of the UI compared to iOS 7 because we already saw a big update from iOS 6 to iOS 7 um, and I use radio application standalone so uh, because there's a lot of people probably using that app uh, better iCloud uh, so um, 
We'll see what happens, but uh, I'm looking forward to iOS 8 at least. Peace out. Hey guys, so I want to do another video here about iOS 8 because uh, 9 to 5 mac have posted a long article about iOS 8 actually and I want to go a little bit more in depth uh, about this main key feature that it seems like Apple's going to focus on in iOS 8 and that is going to be this um, health book app um, so they're going to have big focus on health and, and fitness as well uh, so the, I think this article also is having a lot of pictures Pictures of apps in the App Store uh, that is uh, tracking your fitness and tracking your health, uh, but also some renders that they have been doing themselves uh, based on some rumors about the new Health Book app. Um, so, first of all, uh, here seems to be all, many of the things that you'll be able to track in the Health Book app, and also that's going to be, be having kind of like the same UI look as the Passbook app. This app also might be an app that is taking uh, information, uses the Passbook app, taking information from other